All right, it's Hank here, 1119-2287-224 AM. We're going to infiltrate Corvega. You caught the last episode. You know um, why we're taking this uh, entry point right here. Because it's instead of fighting an uphill battle from one of the lower areas, we're going to go in at the highest point and continue to move down. Um, we're going to be using explosives, throwing knives, suppressed weapons, if it gets really hairy, we might move to the shotgun, or if I can get my hands on something automatic like a uh, Mini Mac, would be really beautiful. That's another mod that I have there, those scope reticles. Sir? Uh, that's not the scope reticle, that's the, um... All right. That's the, let's see... Recon scope... Overhaul or something like that. Pick this for the experience. I'm going to try and use grenades on most of these enemies. I'm trying to think my way through this here. And listen. Be alert. Alright, what I'd like to do is get a grenade down in there somehow. I don't know if it's going to like bounce off the roof or what. If I end up over here in those bright spotlight lights, I'm screwed. If I end up on that side, I'll have a little cover, but not much. And I'm interested in what enemies are going to be coming right here. So, I do have a decoy, I have an alarm clock. Uh, we definitely don't want to fall off this upper level position here. That would be really, really bad. But, you know, me, I'm going to really test it. I guess there's a guy with a mining hat or something maybe on the other side. We've got action over there. Hopefully I can just drop her. Be very careful about that. Alright, now we can use the grenades. Then I'd love to be able to get one inside of that building. If I can get down low enough, I'll chuck one inside. Get to the opposite side and chuck one inside. Or draw them out. That'll work too. Someone there? Yes. I'm gonna switch to the combat knife. I just had that machete because it was kind of novel. But it actually seemed to work really well on the ferals. Because uh, you can block with it a little bit better. Get the hell out of the light fast. Let's see what we got going on here. I could drop down into that dark area. That's, a, that's an idea. Ideally, I'd like to be able to um, mine this corridor over here somehow. This is not an area where I wanted to be uh, trapped. If you 
if you want to use that term trap, like use it loosely. And I keep getting illuminated by uh, something pretty random. So I think the smart thing to do would be to um, drop a little lower. Yeah, let's get some... Uh, I've got grenades, but do we want to play with the throwing knives? Everybody loves throwing knives. See if I can get a shot on anybody. Let's see what kind of enemies we draw out. Any at all. Pack it in, boys. There's nothing out there. Nope. Not so lucky. Guess I got only one option. Only one good option. Fire in the hole! Don't you die on me. Fire in the hole! Okay, cut the shit. Who is that? I ain't cutting the shit. Come get some. There's more shit like that where I can't uh, where I got I got more shit coming. How about that? Or plenty of shit like that remaining. I don't know. Got more shit like that coming, more shit like that on the way. Bring it, you sorry little bastard. Icelanders headgear. That's kind of cool. Who's out there? It's me, motherfucker. Happy birthday. And the last thing I really wanted to do was end up. All right, well, fuck these guys. Do a little combat peek once we get up into that on that other side. I just don't want a raider to pop up right there over the stairs on the point blank. Got one target. Automated machine gun. Let's do it like this. Hmm? Hmm? Huh? What? Shit just blows up on its own. really want them on both sides of me. What the? Show your face. Come on. Ouch. I think we've made enough noise for now not to have to Really be so Can't concerned about yourself. Don't quit, do you? No, I do not. I will kill every single last what one of you motherfuckers. 
Right up your asshole, you little bastard. Let's quiet it down a little bit. We'll just switch back to the ten. Come on out. I'll make it nice and quick. You can trust me. Yep. Trust me. Your ass is grass. Motherfuckers. up here. Take some painkillers. Painkillers. And we'll have a little something to drink. How about Deezer's Lemonade? When you turn up, you're dead. Can't believe all those frags didn't deal with them. It's unreal. Sticks and stones, bitch. Come on, don't don't make me wait. You know I'm gonna shoot you. You're only prolonging the inevitable. Can't risk a uh, miss. That's what I save those criticals for, and I'm bleeding again. Danger, danger. Ain't worried about no danger. My middle name is Hank McGurk Danger. Or, no, wait a second. Ain't Danger McGurk. That would be the right one. There we go. Bunch of pussies. Let's see what I'm talking about with my uh, infiltration point being on the high side. Working my way down. Be able to throw uh, explosives down on my enemies. And being able to run back to cover instead of having them come down and press on me. Makes it a Keep much better open. infiltration point. Yeah, we'll caltrop this entrance here. I got some cal. Yeah, here we go. Caltrops. Go back to the ten. Well, we'll go with the forty-five for a little while. Ah, found you, sorry. He just caltropped it. Just got caltropped. Guy. All right, let's play. You want to play? I got a machete. Let's play. I can dance if you want to dance. Put a little uh, minute work in there. I think that's what that is. I can dance if you want to leave your friends behind. I know it's a little whack and fucking... I know using the word whack is fucking whack, but I don't really give a shit what you think. I'm not here to fucking impress you. We'll caltrop this again. Just in case. And I'll try and grab some throwing knives and do it with throwing knives. It's everybody loves throwing knife kills. They're a real pain in the ass to get. Yeah, what a dick. 
I know raiders can't take kindly to that kind of shit. Don't take kindly to your can around here. You go to your patrol. It's like, uh, if I was a raider, I'd be like, uh, how about you go, um, fuck yourself? Actually, in real life, I'd probably be like, oh, how about you go and fuck yourself? Oh, wow. That is, uh, good, because sometimes in better locational damage, you can pop up in areas. Uh, that's why you have to have fairly good lockpicking skills, because you can pop up in areas and just not get jacked for, uh... Uh, treasure explosives or anything. Alright, caravan, we'll read it. Took down another caravan today, hell yeah, that makes three in one month. To top it off, Freddy came by with good news that, he's, that another caravan is headed our way. Said he spotted some guards, but it's mostly civilians. He even got an old broad dressed like a fortune teller and some joker in a cowboy hat. Gonna ask Jerry for more men to take that car this caravan down. That fucking hat is mine. I'm wearing a hat very similar. If I can find this son of a bitch that's got that hat, I'll start wearing the hat that's on his head. All right, I'm not even going to signal for my allies just yet. I'll do that on exfiltration. Need to think this through a little bit here. Being a... Uh, shit. Let's think this through here a little bit. I would like to lure my enemies into a trap versus... um. Because I want to exfiltrate out through the front up here. And, um, I don't want to open this door here. And have to deal with them on this side. It's just not comfortable, but I can't think of another way in right at the moment. And it's so illuminated, I it's not like I could get down there, open the door, and rush back. Or can I? It's just, uh... This is gonna take us up to the main floor. And maybe it would be better if I just mine the area behind me. So let's do that. We'll do those with standard, uh, fragmentation mines. Nothing fun. I was hoping for maybe drugs or soda. I'm not taking those half pound friggin' milk bottles. Now, see, uh, I believe I said in one of my other videos. That um, what you definitely don't want to do is mine an area that you might have to fall back to with raiders and chase and better uh, and improved explosives. But I'm going to make an exception to this rule. And I hope it doesn't kill me. Because it very well could. Now my ob idea is I'm going to run to that terminal... And I'm going to fire it up, and I'm going to let the Petetron engage. If I fail to hack the computer in my first attempt, it's my ass, and i got to run. Alright, let's start with Glove. Alright. It could be north. What's going to give me more clues? It would be north if it give me more clues. All right. Beautiful. Powering up. 
And now I can just kind of hide over here. Unidentified intruder detected. And let them fucking have at it. Get eyes on while we're out of here. On hostile target. Law abiding. another raider out there somewhere. Just let all that shit blow up there. <laughs> Ooh wee! Ooh wee! Man, I'm glad I have walk into that. Just gotta give it a second. I don't know what else is on fire, but shit is exploding everywhere. I'm gonna have to deal with that friggin' robot in a fast way. And the fastest way I know of is with explosives. There is no problem that cannot be solved by the application of high explosive. I like time grenades a little bit better than, um, those shit. Time grenades a little bit better than, than impact grenades, and that right there is a prime example of why. Because if that was a baseball grenade, it would have killed me. If it was a frag, I'd have had enough time to run. So, one more raider out there on this floor. Probably on the bottom level. I hate to turn my back on her. But let's mine this area. Oh shit. Fucking up here. Not paying attention. Let's uh let's drop the frag mine and make sure nobody comes up the stairs. Let's deal with whatever in the f whatever is out here. Uh, looking for automated turrets. There's one that's been destroyed up there. Use the binos to see maybe if we can get a... Something a little more clear. Now this is one of those uh, situations where I would really like to be able to switch to um, a smaller a sight picture like six times, four times or six times. But you can only have two uh, types on your optics, so you have to go with. Have to go. Uh. The night vision and the ten times. That's what's ultimately the most useful. But whatever is out, that extra thing is out here is going to me out. You don't want to come this far and walk around the corner and run right into a friggin' raider with a shotgun. And that's it for you. And it would be. That would be your ass. It would be game over. Alright, so how do we deal with that? I think with the same thing we would usually deal with most things with. I'm gonna let you guess. God damn it! I am fucking up here. Ain't that about a bitch? What the hell was that? Shit, there are like many of them. I don't know what the fuck and where the fuck they're coming from. This is bullshit. Where in the hell are they? Got me a little 
freaked out here. It's like I say, you don't want to come this far to get picked off at the very end. We'll take the beer. So. I don't know. We'll go with the 45. Probably not the most safe choice. But. I'm clearly not all about playing it safe. Any goodies? Oh yeah, I need that day tripper. Got addicted to it once, it didn't stop me from using it some more. It's a good charisma booster. Chalk. Gotta take that to make ex expired painkillers, sealed painkillers. Yeah, we're just gonna creep on over here. Stupid bastards. Scared, huh? No. Oh, there you are, sweet cakes. Ouch, that must have hurt. Or maybe that's just one of those types of things that you never see coming. Maybe you're just dead before you know it. Is that guy below me? That's certainly what it sounded like. He could be all the way on another floor near my exfiltration point. I don't really know. It's one thing about Corvega that, that the way it's arranged is you can never be dead certain about where those guys are from where they are. So I typically don't worry about it too much. Oh yeah, a nuke grenade. Love explosives and we'll take that rat poison because when I get chemistry one I'll start building chemical bombs. Silver pocket watch, we'll read on some grognak. A little melee bonus. All right, Jared, what you got? Setting up shop. Gunfire is finally quieted down. I guess that means the Alani and Gristle wiped up the last of the ghouls that are currently serving as someone's meal. Now that Lexington is secure, I can finally get to work. Stop. Nothing is working. The old woman, she used to huff some jet, pop some pills, and she'd start babbling, spouting vision after vision. And then they all turned out true. The raiders burning the town, killing the parents, stealing the kids, stealing me. I remember the look in her eyes when she saw my fake kid. You're going to be a monster. All true. If I get that sort of power, that sight, the commonwealth, the other gangs, no one will have a prayer. But nothing's working. Maybe I need to try upping the dosage. I'm going to need another bucket. Making himself sick on drugs. Subject, it's not the Kims. They're just a trigger for the sight. It's me. I'm the problem. Wish I'd realized it before my arms look like pink cushions, but at least it's a new lead. I need to subjects. Experiments continue. Still no successes, but the rumor of free chems has bought plenty of new recruits. Ranks are nearly back up to where they were before we cleaned out Lexington. Lonnie thinks it's a waste of time. It says we need to spend our time building up our defenses. But Lonnie doesn't make the decisions. I do. She does seem to be enjoying her new position, though. Maybe uh, another dose of Psycho will get her visions firing. She's here. Russell says there's a caravan heading this way. Some joker with a cowboy hat, a laser musket, three civilians, and one frail old woman dressed like a fortune teller. It's her. I know it's her. I sent Gristle to collect her. I wonder if she'll recognize me. Of course she will. She saw this coming after all. Yeah, it will shut everything down. I think I can load them. Um, just, just make sure everything is shut down. I have a, I thought I have a hack, yeah, a turret override program. Picked it up in the graveyard. Let's 
Gramble will target you all. Override will make you a min. Sabotage will cause self destruct. Sabotage them. Alright. Take that back with me. Uh, shut the fuck up, is there? I hear something. Of course not. Of course not. These guys are not on our level. They're below us somewhere. There's your laser musket. One of them. We'll take them because they're actually pretty good for settlers to use. They're quite powerful weapons. If used uh, properly. You guys have to start up a... Another round of bullshit treasure, though. What the fuck was that? It's me, asshole. No, you're below me, though, and you'll never come up here to engage me. Nothing good. Man, that shit really did uh, totally blow this whole floor up. Now I could exfiltrate now and be done with it. What the hell was that? Or I could show a little, a little courage and just kill absolutely everybody. And I've sometimes said cowards live longest because I could e exfiltrate right here. Gotcha. Back it in, boys. There's nothing out there. But, uh, uh, curiosity's gonna get the better of me, and we're gonna go ahead and attack our way through the entire complex. Stick with the plan. This lower area down here, I might avoid that, actually. Let's mine it and, uh, just let it be. Got an idea. Let's try this out. It was probably a bad move, but sometimes you just have to try things. When you turn up, you're dead. Coward hides. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, so I'm out of frags. That's all right. We'll go with flashbangs. They might be a little safer anyway. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. You're a chicken shit. What the fuck was that? Suck that, motherfucker. Somebody downstairs is shooting at that alarm clock. That's what that gunfire is. Now the question is, do I go down there and fuck them up, or do I just go on ahead with my day? I'm just gonna go on ahead with my day. For drugs or any other last things here. Now, see, my tactical light when I'm using the 45 is actually attached to the pistol. So that's uh, kind of interesting. I would rather have the laser on it, but it's uh, it's different than the directed uh, beam that comes off my pit boy. Got half a mind to go downstairs and murder that guy. Still debating it. But I'm gonna have to go with, uh, no, we're not gonna do that. Sometimes you just don't wanna. Do something stupid there at the very end. It's been Hank. Catch you guys on the flip side.